Good morning, class. So today we are going to continue our lesson in science on investigating natural resources. Uh, our target for today will be I can examine the properties of soil, including the different colors and varieties of soil. So let's begin. So uh, like we were talking about yesterday, soil is the layer of loose material that covers most of Earth's land. A key ingredient of soil is its particles. These particles are tiny pieces of different kinds of rock. This broken down rock can contain different minerals. Air and water are other non-living ingredients in soil. These non-living materials are important to the plants that grow in the soil. And we have a variety of soils, okay? All soils are not alike. There are many different types. Texas, for example, has 1,300 different types of soil. Houston black soils are found in central Texas from north of Dallas to San Antonio. In rural areas, these soils are used for growing cotton, corn, grain, sorghum, and other crops. Houston black soils are not found in any other state. In eastern Texas, the soils contain extremely small rock particles. Timberlands are, uh, grow here. In the Panhandle and High Plains region, the soils contain a great deal of humus, not hummus, humus. These soils, which formed under grasslands, are very fertile. West Texas has dry desert soils. And these are examples here of the different soils. Okay, so let's talk about properties of soil. Soil samples from a few yards apart can be very different. One difference is often the amount of humus, not hummus, in the soil. Other differences in soil samples have to do with the properties of soil. These properties include the ability to support plant growth, the color, the texture, and the ability to hold water. Today, we're going to be talking about the color and the texture. So, different so uh, differences in soil properties include the ability, to, again, to support plant growth, color, texture, and the ability to hold water. Okay, and we have three main different types of soil. We have sand, we have silt, and we have clay. Okay, so let's talk about the color. The minerals in a rock may affect its color. Iron makes soil look red. Humus, there's my arrow, humus may affect color too. Soil with a lot of humus is dark brown color. Now uh, let's talk about the texture. The texture or feel of soil can depend on the size of the particles in the soil. Large particles give soil a rough texture. Small particles give, sm uh, give soil a smooth texture. Okay. Mm, let's talk about sand. Sand can be different colors, such as tan, white, green, and black. Sand soils feel rough and gritty. These are different colors of real sand around the world. And notice how they're different colors. I'm sorry, I don't have the moving pictures today. They didn't have any for, for sand. Then we have silt. Silt is usually different shades of brown, depending on the material that are in it. Silt feels smoother than sand particles. And we have clay. The color of clay include gray, I mean red, gray, and blue. Wet clay feels smooth and sticky. And these are examples of, um, that I found online, different pictures of different types of clay. Look at all the different colors here. And then I don't know if you guys remember the video from yesterday. Did you see the two girls that were uh, painted their mud with clay, uh, their face with clay? That looked really nice. Uh -uh. So in conclusion, guys, differences in soil properties include the ability to grow, support plant growth, color, texture, and the ability to hold water. The minerals in soil may affect its color. Iron makes soil look red. Humus, where is my arrow? Humus may affect color too. Soil with a lot of humus is a dark brown color. The texture or feel of soil can depend on the size of the particles in the soil. And large particles give soil a rough texture. 
Small particles give soil a smooth texture. So what I'd like you guys to do is go ahead and watch the video on soil and complete the activity afterwards. I couldn't find any little moving ones, so I'll leave you guys with the little dog from yesterday digging in the soil. I hope you guys enjoy the video.